Okay, so this is probably the easiest stamp on earth to carve. The first thing you want to do is make sure that your pencil eraser is flat. So I'm just erasing and you can see all the little pieces of the eraser coming off onto my craft mat until I'm sure I have a flat surface. If it still doesn't look flat when you look at it from the side, make sure you're holding it straight up and down and rub. Also, if you have a new pencil, you don't have to do this. It's just because I have a used pencil. Okay, that's looking flatter. So again, make sure I'm holding it straight up and down and rub. And that looks nice and flat. So we're not gonna carve anything super fancy and I'm just gonna use a craft knife to do it. So if you want to draw on here, if you are feeling anxious, you can take a ballpoint pen and just make a couple marks. So I'm just cutting with the knife, this kind of triangle shape. And then I'm going to sort of scoop out that triangle shape. Be careful that you don't cut yourself. And just like that, you can see my triangle shape has come out. So then I'm gonna do the same thing across. I cut down, I cut down, and then I'm gonna come across and under and try it from the other side as well until I manage to wiggle that piece of rubber out. So I can see my ink on my stamp. There it is. And if you find that you have ragged edges, which I do, you can fix it up. So that should fix my ragged edge. Let's see. Much better. And here are two other pencil eraser stamps that I did recently. So this one is a heart, as you can see. And this one is a cross cut out. So I have a bow, I have this sort of plus sign or cross shape, and I have a heart. And they're all just done on simple pencil erasers.